Hello! In this video, we will prove the trigonometric identity 1 over 1 minus cosine of x minus 1 over 1 plus cosine of x equals 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. To prove this identity, we have to show that we can change the expression on one side or on both sides so that both sides look identical. To the left, we have the fundamental trigonometric identities. And now I will start with the left side because it looks more complicated and I will simplify it so that it looks identical to the right side. So on this side we have two fractions and to subtract them we need the least common denominator. And the least common denominator is the product of 1 minus cosine of x and 1 plus cosine of x. So, in the first fraction, we will multiply both the numerator and the denominator by 1 plus cosine of x. So, here we have the fraction 1 over 1 minus cosine of x. And now, we will multiply the numerator by 1 plus cosine of x and the denominator by 1 plus cosine of x. Now, in the second fraction, we will multiply both the numerator and the denominator by 1 minus cosine of x. So, the fraction we have is 1 over 1 plus cosine of x. And now, we will multiply both the numerator and the denominator by 1 minus cosine of x. And on the right side, we have 2 cotangent of x, cosecant of x. And now, on the left side, both fractions have the same denominator. Then, in the numerators, I will remove these parentheses and I will rewrite the whole identity. So, here we have it, and now let's subtract these two fractions. We will have now only one fraction with the denominator of 1 minus cosine of x times 1 plus cosine of x. Then in the numerator we will have 1 plus cosine of x. And now this negative has to be distributed to each term. So then we will have minus 1 plus cosine of x. Then down here we will write minus 1 plus cosine of x. And on the right side 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. And now on the left side, 1 and negative 1 will cancel. And cosine of x plus cosine of x is 2 cosine of x. Now in the denominator, to multiply these two expressions, we will use the formula for the product of a sum and a difference. The formula is a plus b times a minus b is a squared minus b squared. Then according to this formula, 1 minus cosine of x times 1 plus cosine of x is 1 squared minus cosine squared of x. Then the new denominator will be 1 minus cosine squared of x. And on the right side, 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. Now in the next step, we will use the first Pythagorean identity. This identity is sine squared of x plus cosine squared of x equals 1. In this identity, if we take 1 and we subtract cosine squared of x, then we will get sine squared of x. So then, we will replace 1 minus cosine squared of x with sine squared of x. Then we will write 2 cosine of x over sine squared of x equals 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. Now I will rewrite the left side as 2 cosine of x over sine of x times 1 over sine of x. And the right side is still 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. And now, according to the quotient identities, cosine of x over sine of x is cotangent of x. 
and according to the reciprocal identities, 1 over sine of x is cosecant of x. Then on the left side we will have 2 cotangent of x times cosecant of x equals 2 cotangent of x cosecant of x. So now both sides look identical. Thank you for watching the whole video. Please subscribe, leave a comment and come back for more math.